Now, this event was geared towards the youth and it was supposed to happen on National Coming Out Day, which is next month. However, it has been canceled after the library received multiple threats. We are offering Drag Queen Bingo in an effort to support the teens in our community who identify with the LGBTQIA plus community. Drag Queen Bingo was supposed to be an event where teens would play a few rounds of bingo and win the prizes like gift cards here at Downers Grove's Public Library. It was going to be hosted by a drag queen named Aurora Devine, whose tab was already paid for by an anonymous donor, but all of that is now canceled. In a statement, the library's director said, quote, hate did not win today. It went on to say, we tried our best to make drag queen bingo happen. However, due to the severity of the threats made against the library, we have been forced to cancel the event, end quote. It was an event that would help celebrate National Coming Out Day, which is October 11th. Illinois Congressman Sean Kasson released a statement saying, quote, I'm incredibly disheartened to hear that Downers Grove Public Library is canceling their upcoming event, one meant to celebrate self-identity and self-expression, because Keith Pacal in Awake, Illinois, created an unsafe environment in our community, end quote. Now, Keith Pacal is a Republican candidate running against Kasson. He was against the event happening at the library Tuesday morning. He sent us a statement saying, quote, as I said in multiple interviews, threats and violence are never appropriate and should be prosecuted to the full extent of the law. However, differences of opinion should be encouraged in America, and I stand by my original position that this event, targeted to minors, was inappropriate and unacceptable use of taxpayer funds, end quote. Outside the library, people had no problem voicing their opinions on the event. It was a program they thought the community needed. They had people sign up for it. I wish they had stood up behind it, if they possibly could. We've got kids that went through the whole system here. Um, we did feel that seventh grade was, was a bit young for that. I think that that was one of the turning points. And so far, it has not been determined if this event will be rescheduled or if the location will change for the October 11th date. Of course, we'll keep you updated as we receive more information on this. For now, we're in Downers Grove. I'm Glenn Marshall, WGN News. Our Kelly's attorney.